Hello everybody and welcome to the North Carolina Residential Square Footage Guidelines and the Power of Price Per Square Foot. So what are we going to talk about today? Everybody's favorite subject, square footage. Well, maybe not everybody's favorite subject, but we're going to talk about a number that we rarely talk about. You know, it's a number that we use every day. You know, we all use the magical price per square foot, but we hardly ever talk about the number, where it comes from, and how important it is. So in this class, we're going to show you how something as simple as using an accurate square footage total can completely change whether you have a smooth transaction, a low appraisal, or a lost sale based on nothing more than the size of the home. You know, I hope that we're going to change your perspective on the topic of square footage, and by the end of this class, you'll have a whole new idea about the extraordinary power of price per square foot. My name is Hamp Thomas. I'm a realtor, and I'm also an appraiser, and I've been studying this topic for a very long time, and I hope that you enjoy this class. So. Thanks for joining us and let's get started.